Hi guys, welcome back. So today's video is like a little mini haul that I did while I was home for the weekend last weekend. So the first weekend in November, I went on a little shopping spree and also I feel like a lot of you may know that Sephora was having their VIB Rouge sale, 20% off. So I took a little bit of advantage of that and yeah. I just got some goodies, so if you want to see what I got on my little mini shopping spree, then just keep on watching. Okay, so you want to do makeup first or clothes first? Let's do makeup. That's what everyone's here for, makeup. Let's do makeup. So I didn't get much because you guys know I'm in college, can't afford too much, you know. But I did try to get some stuff that I've been wanting for a little bit and I necessarily didn't want to just buy, you know what I mean? I wanted to wait a little bit. So the first thing I got was this Marc Jacobs Highliner. So, so this is their gel eyeliner and I got it in black and I am so excited to use this because I've heard so many people rave about this. So it just looks like this and I'm so pumped to use this and it's a twist up. Oh, yes. I'm so excited. Um, this was a little pricey, but oh my god, it's so smooth. <gasps> I also got a concealer. So this is the Kat Von D Locket Concealer. Um, I had a little mini sample of this when it first came out and then I used to love it and I just, I think I forgot about it, especially because I'm so obsessed with my Tarte Shape Tape. So I wanted to pick it up. I got the full size and I got the shade L9 Neutral. Yeah, light neutral, light nine neutral. That's weird, but that's the shade I got. Hopefully it's not too light. Um, I am pretty fair right now, as you can see, so I wanted to get a fair enough um, concealer, but I can always exchange it if it isn't my shade. I didn't really swatch it, I just kind of like picked it up because I was in a rush. 24 hour wear, crease proof, full coverage, and hydrating. So it definitely is full coverage, I remember that. So I'm excited to try it out again. I also got the House of Lashes Lash Glue. Um, I got the clear white one because they were out of the black and pretty much I've only used clear so I was like, why get black? So I just got this one, I picked it up. Um, I needed a better lash glue because the duo one was not working for me anymore. My lashes always, like, they kept coming off during the day, so it was really annoying me. So I, that's why I haven't been wearing lashes for a long time, because I just, it's, like, annoying. They just fall off. I don't know why. Um, but I definitely heard this is, like, super glue to your eyes, so I'm excited about that, because that's what I need. <laughs> Last product I got from Sephora for the Rouge event is this YSL Blur Primer. I know it, there's, like, a there's this top name that's like, I don't even know, what is that, French or something? I don't know. What caught my eye is what it looks like. Like, this is stunning. Stunning. Oh my goodness. It's so pretty. And I put it on my hand and I like swatched it and rubbed it on the back of my hand and I was like, holy crap, this feels good. So this was the most expensive item that I bought, but I splurged a little bit because, you know, I wanted to. <laughs> That's all I got from Sephora because that alone came to $100 already and I was like, holy crap, Christmas is coming up, I need to stop spending money on myself. So, um, <laughs> as I whip up more pr products that I bought. So then I went to TJ Maxx after I went to the gym, I believe, on Thursday. Yeah, I went to the gym back home on Thursday and I was getting annoyed because a lot of my gym clothes don't fit me right like my leggings either like fall down while I'm like squatting or like doing leg exercises or even like on the Stairmaster so it's like really annoying having to just keep pull them up because they're not technically like workout pants I only have like five workout pants but they were just getting old and annoying and I also wanted to start um, incorporating like workout videos on my YouTube channel if you guys want to see those let me know down below. I will definitely start doing that as soon as I get a vlogging camera, but I also want to start buying like longer crop tops so I can just wear leggings and a crop top to the gym without like my whole stomach showing because like my gym isn't the type of gym where like you just like, you know, walk around like that, I guess. I don't know. Maybe it's just me, but 
Um, I bought this crop top. It's obvious, it's like longer, so you can just wear it with just mm -hmm. leggings, high-waisted leggings. And it's just plain. It's like a light gray. And then on the back, it's so cute. It has like this mesh detailing right there, as you can see, like right here. I believe this was $15, so not too bad, honestly. And it's a really nice material. Like I already wore it to the gym on Friday, so the day after I got it. But it's such a nice material. It's really soft, and it like fits me perfectly. Perfectly. Not too tight, not too loose. It also has built-in padding in it, so like you're not so you won't nip through it, you know what I mean, while you're working out. And then I also purchased pants to go with it because I didn't really have any high enough waisted pants to wear with that. So these are the leggings. They're a really dark navy blue. I'm not sure if you guys can tell. Uh, probably. But they're from the brand 90 degree. Um these are so nice. Like, I love these. And these, I think, were on sale. These were on clearance for $13. And they feel like $50 leggings. Like, they're so nice. They go up high-waisted, so, like, it fits my waist perfectly. And it makes my booty look a little bigger <laughs> than it is. And they're just all the way down to my ankles. And they're just really tight and really comfortable, too. And they don't fall down. That's what I was most excited about for wearing these to the gym to test if they fell down when I worked out in them and they did it and I'm pumped. I kind of want to, does 90 degree have a website because I'll definitely buy them like full price. They're not too expensive. Like if they're at TJ Maxx, obviously I'll purchase them if I see them, but this was kind of like a hit or miss, you know what I mean? So I definitely want to purchase more. I wonder if they have a website. I'm going to check that out after this video. And then the last thing I purchased was a blender bottle because I have like a really mini one and it was not working out. I needed a bigger one and I kept stealing Matt's, um, my boyfriend, if you didn't know, if you're new. Um, yeah, Matt's my boyfriend and he has like five blender bottles. So I just kept stealing his and I was like, all right, I need to get my own. So I found this at TJ Maxx too. And I've seen these before, but none of them had this little hook for your little finger to carry it around so it's easier so I was just like browsing looking at the workout stuff and I saw this and I was like yes that's perfect because I wanted a white one and I wanted it to look more feminine you know I didn't want like a black one or something I wanted white just because I'm like that and it had the little hook so it's so cute I've been drinking water like non-stop. I feel like because I bought this, I've been drinking water like non-stop now. Because I feel like it's just so much easier to drink water. I don't know why compared to other water bottles. Maybe it's just a mental thing, but I have no idea. And this was only $5, so that was pretty cheap. So yeah, those are all of the products that I splurged on over the weekend while I was home. Um, I don't think I can do that anymore because Christmas is coming up and your girl has to start purchasing some Christmas gifts for her loved ones. I hope you guys enjoyed this little mini haul. Um, let me know if you guys have any of these products and if you love them or hate them. I would love to hear. And I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye, loves. Also, I forgot to tell you guys again, subscribe if you're not already. It would mean the world to me. Okay, bye.